Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Mind Z. Today, we're going to do body offloads. So the first thing is, you need to wait for it to be nighttime. And before I delay any longer, we're going to go in because nighttime is running out. Alright, now I'll explain everything else. Um, if you guys want to do this dungeon on your own, it's a lot of fun, and it is a great challenge. But if you watch the video, um, you'll know exactly what to do. So it's a little less fun, but still you get the dungeon done. Alright, up. You ready to lead the way? Yeah. Alright. So, I had this recording ready, and it was ready to go on Sunday, and then the dungeon got changed, so I was told, oh no, don't upload it. Okay, first head, you gotta right-click the skulls, that's the idea of the dungeon. Um, Alright, cool. Okay, so the first on that, um, it says, beware of your surroundings, not everything is the same. Okay. Ah, so that's different. This one guy here, alright. And then uh, through next, perseverance. Next, uh, it should spawn some zombies, so why? Okay, you'll appear over there. Yeah, that's normal. So I've seen one change already, but uh, that's pretty easy. And yep. Easy peasy. Uh, this is my gear, by the way, in case you're wondering. Yep. This skull. Okay. Whew. Alright, so now it looks like we're at the beginning, but as you can see at the top, there's a little bit of wool, which is supposed to mimic kind of the sky. Um, so yeah, we're definitely at a different place now. There was supposed to be a health potion chest, but it was spawned. Okay, so health potion chest, cool. Good to know. I'll put some food here. Um, as you go higher into the dungeon, uh, there will be some zombie spawners as well, but uh, we'll get to that. <sighs> Spooky, scary dungeon with all its vines and stuff. All right, what's next? Okay, now, there you go. Now we click the head and go inside. Okay, so that's the same. <laughs> now we click the head. Yep, that's still the same. So we click his head, boom. And the yeah, torch. Ooh, the torch to the right of the skull. Yeah. Okay, that's different because before it used to be this iron fence here. Nice, okay. Oh, oh. five. Okay, so don't do that one at the same time. <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> okay, hold on up, hold on. Um, you're gonna need to speak up a little bit. Let's just. Oh, what did I do? All right, all right. Let's try that. This head. Okay. All right. Cool. 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 Okay, this will spawn four zombies. Yeah, four zombies, yeah. but they're a little delayed. Yeah. I know. Oh, I got teleported by accident. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Alright, chill. Okay. Okay, now... Alright, hold on. So I'm just gonna point out what head... What what head was it that we touched? Uh, the one that's, like, this way. Alright, so... Whoa, okay. This is the closest this way. I'll, I'll leave a little picture so you guys can see. Alright, what's next? Okay, uh, this redstone wire. Okay. So, I'm pretty sure you can go like this as well, hit these lava things. And some skulls will pop up, just in case this is bugged. Yeah. Just in case that's a, a bug, um, that's what you do. And we come up here. And there's a potion chest. Oh, it didn't spawn again, right? Okay, potion chest. Yeah, this one's the same. Kind of come up here. Yeah? Yeah, and right click the wither skull. Yeah, so there's a little skull here. A little wither I skull. One's gonna be my, my spawn, I'm not sure. No, no, I think this one's safe. Okay. Okay, now we click. This head. Ooh, that's different. All right. Yep. Uh, we walk on both pressure plates. Make both? Sure both? Yeah. You only walked on the left one. Really? Yeah. So left it one. It must be glitched for you. It must be glitched for you because I walked on both on my screen. Okay. All right. Okay. Now we right click this skull. Okay. And this torch behind. Okay, the torch is the same. Yeah. So we can hit the torch. Make sure not to hit the skull, that bad things happen. <laughs> and then we're in this room, which is the end room. <gasps> the, has, oh yeah, the loot spawn. Alright, alright. Okay, so, uh, we just now randomly click the skull until we get the Yeah, right randomly don't click. Don't go too fast. Don't go too fast, because when there are V2, we need to click the right one. Oh yeah, this, oh yeah, correct the light one. Well, there you go. Okay. And we've chosen wisely. Uh, before, a bunch of chests used to spawn here, but uh, once you got the maze down, 
it becomes a very easy farmable thing, so people are like, nope. And we got two iron chest plates. <laughs> some helmets of vision. Some iron boots. And iron helmet. You can take it off. Alright, and the helmet of vision. That was supposed to be uh, two chests here and two chests here. Like two double chests. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I guess they don't spawn in. Okay, so a double chest here and a double chest here. Cool. And then. Oh, yeah, do you want one of the legendaries? Uh, sure, I'll use it as a helmet. <laughs> It's a helmet of vision, which I'm going to leave in my inventory because for some reason it doesn't do anything. Alright, and boom. Alright, and that's body offload. Um, okay, so I would do some legendary testing, but like, testing, and I don't see anything. There's no difference to me. And as you can see, it is daytime, so the dungeon is kind of closed. Alrighty, guys. So that's it? Yeah. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Uh, this is our first uh, MindZ post update dungeon. I hope you all enjoyed. It was well worth the wait for me. Um, oh my goodness, I was at full health. I hate you. <laughs> and um, yeah, so that's our dungeon for this week. Uh, next week, hopefully, we'll get something else for you. And if not, we will see you all next time.